Uh, I would like to see more day games. Uh, I would like to see more day games in the uh, during the uh, uh, playoffs. More day games during the uh, <clears throat> pardon me than in the um, in the World Series. Uh, I, I think that we're getting away from the time where we could have our children, the kids, to enjoy the game, especially on Saturdays and Sundays. You know, it's more night games now. You know, I mean, and kids have to go to school. So I, that that would be one change I would make. And I understand that that's going to be hard because what are you going to do with your advertisers? You know, I mean, you, they're going to be griping. But still, you know, I think that we need to do something in order to change the format of the game as far as the time is concerned. I don't know that I would be happy. You know, I am very satisfied with it, with having played in the era in which I played in. You know, I mean, it's never going to be that many Hall of Famers that I think that people can look at, you know, and you can look at every team that played in the big leagues. I mean, practically every team. And each one of them probably had at least, I would say, two, one or two Hall of Famers on them. And it's going to be tough to get that because kids today is going to make so much money. They're going to play for four or five years, and they're going to retire. And you're going to have trouble putting that kind of uh, kids into the Hall of Fame. You know, after 23 years that I played baseball, uh, I never was on a disabled list. And, of course, um, after my career was over with, my right knee started giving me a lot of trouble, you know. And rather than having surgery, uh, I decided to really to try some other things, you know. And so I, uh, I had a good friend of mine who uh, uh, gave me some advice and told me, he said, why don't you try this, send this one. And sure enough, I tried it. And I haven't had any trouble with my knees at all. It really, if you think about it, you know, 23 years of playing baseball and constantly running in and out, even though, you know, from the outfield back to the bench and then, of course, hitting and running to bases and sliding and et cetera. You know, uh, your knees and your body take the horrible beating, you know. So I just feel like I was extremely lucky. So now I'm able to move around a little bit. I'm able to do some of the things I want to do. When I was coming along, you know, it was a it was a privilege to sign autographs. It was a privilege to do some of the things that we were called upon to do. You know, uh, nowadays I think the union is so involved in everything that these players do that they'll tell them quick. You know, you don't have to do this. You don't have to do this. You don't have to play here. I think it, it's so unionized. You know, I mean, the union has, which is good in some ways, but I think in some ways it has hurt some of the players. I don't know. I think I think I would change some of the format of of what baseball means to America. You know, I mean, I would I would change and say, hey, you know, if you uh, if you have the privilege of playing in this great game that we have, then you ought to be able to give something back. I'm not talking about money. I'm talking about some of your time because you know, and I I, I keep talking about the kids because they are the ones that is going to keep the game moving the way it's supposed to move. And that's what I like to see. I like to see players get more involved with young people.